Here's your Storm Track 7 forecast. Good afternoon. I'm Storm Track 7 meteorologist Brandon Libby. It's another gorgeous day outside. Plenty of sunshine as high pressure is in control. Temperatures will once again be mild as winds will be a little lighter today. We'll keep the sunshine for tomorrow. Winds will start to pick back up and so that will warm things even more. Getting into the mid and upper 50s could hit the 60s on Sunday as we do get a little more cloud cover but an even stronger south wind. As far as today goes, this is what we're looking at. Low to mid 50s across the entire viewing area. East southeast wind about 5 to 15 miles per hour. Sunny skies continue and any snow that's left out there will continue to melt. Temperatures drop back down to the mid and upper 20s for tonight with clear skies. We'll see a south southeast wind 5 to 10 miles per hour. So you notice the winds are shifting just a bit more so to the south and so that will lead to some warmer temperatures for Saturday again mid to upper 50s still Completely sunny skies are expected. We do get the more cloud cover for Sunday, but again, we're back into the 60s, so feeling a lot like spring this weekend. First day of spring is going to be on Saturday, and hopefully you enjoy it because we are tracking a bit of rain push again to kick off the work week. We'll start to see the best chance for rain um, arriving Sunday night into Monday, and so you see that low pressure system uh, riding quickly to the north. We'll stay on the warm side of things, so continuing with a soaking rain there for Monday night into Tuesday. It could be all day long that we see that rain. And as that low pressure system goes right overhead for Tuesday night into Wednesday, maybe getting a bit of cool air, a slight chance for a wintry mix north of Highway 18. But I think most of us should avoid that and certainly no accumulations of snow or ice. Everything will push out on Wednesday, but again, could be a fairly soggy system. Half an inch to an inch and a half here for eastern Iowa, and a little more rain is expected in western Iowa. Could be talking about one and a half to two and a half inches of rain there. So, a bit of a soggy start to the work week, but temperatures should remain fairly mild with highs in the 50s. We'll see our lows in the 40s and then dropping to the upper 30s by Tuesday night. And then by Thursday and Friday, still some cloud cover out there, but a bit drier. So, not a great week overall, but Temperatures will stay in the mid 50s to round out the week and we'll track more rain chances heading into Saturday and Sunday as temperatures will drop down to the upper 40s by the end of the weekend.